Lampedusa is in crisis. That's according to the mayor of the small Mediterranean island. 7,000 migrants and refugees arrived by sea within just two days this week. That's more than the island's local population. Hundreds are now being moved to Sicily, as the Lampedusa Reception Center is already taking in 15 times more migrants than its official capacity. The United Nations is calling for a Europe-wide solution. This is a problem that is not only a problem of the countries that receive this influx, it's a problem of the European continent and in particular the European Union. And there must be mechanisms of solidarity and burden sharing that are effective in this regard. Lampedusa is Italy's southernmost port and the closest one for those crossing the Mediterranean from North Africa. They often arrive on overcrowded, flimsy boats. Almost 2,000 people have died making the journey so far this year. The latest victim, a five-month-old baby who died on Wednesday after a boat capsized near the island. What is happening in Lampedusa, the dead baby represents the death of Europe. It's political, cultural, social death and the death of its values because Italy is alone. I don't know where the solidarity, the inclusiveness, the sharing is. Basically, we have to go it alone. Tens of thousands of migrants are undeterred by the risks. More than 123,000 have arrived in Italy by boat so far this year. That's double the number recorded in the same period last year. Dmitry Medvedenko, Al Jazeera. Well, Jacob Fruman is tactical coordinator.